The topic of discussion for today is insects. Did you know that dragonflies have a 360 degree vision? Wow, what a vision. They can in fact see everything. And do you know what's the speed at which the dragonfly flies? It's almost 100 kilometers an hour. Wow, now that's really fast. So come let us make a dragonfly and maybe ours may not fly as fast, but yeah, it will certainly move. Wanna make it? So come let's begin. To make this we will require OHP or a plastic sheet, some colourful chart papers, flexible wire, round tip safety scissors, glue, thumb pin, straws, tape, colours and markers. So first of all we will take this OHP sheet which is easily available at any stationery store. We will sketch a dragonfly on it. I am using a permanent marker. I am making a freehand drawing but if you want you can use the reference from a magazine or a book on science. Make patterns on the body. Now the wings of a dragonfly are normally very big. Okay, so the sketch of the dragonfly is done. Now we must cut it cleanly. So here I've cleanly cut it and removed the dragonfly. Now what I'm going to do is I will flip it and color it on the back side. We're using acrylic colors here and since we're coloring on the back, it doesn't matter if it is untidy as it will appear very neat when viewed from the front. Let's leave it aside to dry and in the meanwhile I'll show you how to make the mechanism for the mechanical toy. So here we'll take this flexible wire and bend the upper portion into a U shape. And in this way we will make the U which we'll fix on the dragonfly. But before that, let's take this straw and cut the upper portion into half with scissors. And now to give your dragonfly a more realistic effect, we can cut the shape of some flowers and maybe an interesting leaf on which the dragonfly is flying. So I've made a leaf-like shape here. And we'll paste it here. And now we'll stick it to our straw over here. But before that, let's attach the dragonfly. First of all, we'll place an eraser on top for safety and pierce a hole here with a thumb pin. Now we'll push this wire through the hole and it will go through easily when we press the other end slightly but we must be very careful and we'll press the other end downwards like this so that it gets fixed here and now that this is properly fixed on it we'll slightly fold the wings we'll push this bottom end through the straw here and these two ends of the straw which we have after cutting we'll stick them under the wings of the dragonfly can you see this? I'm using transparent tape here now let's stick the other side. Now we'll put the flower that we had made under it. Let's also add the leaf made of colored paper. So now we've placed the leaves under it. Now we'll fold the area here where the body is touching the straw and repeat the same on the other side. After that we'll just tightly hold the straw and pull it up and down, that's all. Come let me show you once again how this can be made. First of all sketch a dragonfly on an OHP or a plastic sheet. Then cut it and color it. After that take a flexible wire and bend one of its ends into a U shape and attach it to the center of the dragonfly's body. Then take a straw, cut its upper end into two and nicely tape it to the wings of the dragonfly. Now fold it a bit so that it creases, decorate the straw to give it a realistic effect and when you move it from below, you will see that your dragonfly is absolutely ready.